I study pharmacy. Woo! <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Best character. Here you are. Oh, you sussy. Kick him in the shins. Drink, 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 drink. Katie. Like, I'm kind of getting cold right Katie. now. Katie. I'm kind of getting cold Katie, right now. Katie, this is I'm, live. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm like kind of getting cold right now. Regarding the last night's interrupted seance, I decided not to continue. I decided not to continue with it tonight. Kitty, you good? Yeah, Mr. Evans and I. Are you sleeping? <laughs> Are you really? Came after breakfast. Kitty, <laughs> what? Why are you so quiet? What? What did you do? I didn't do anything. I'm so concerning. <laughs> <laughs> I am concerning, but I am still considering our other options. You're stealing Leanne's brand. Our options going forward. I hope to come to a decision as soon as possible, but... I see. Understood. To be honest, I feel a little re I feel relief for not doing it tonight. Oh, however, I do have work to do, so please decide quickly. I don't mind anything. I think don't rush. Um, think carefully and decide. I'll be waiting for you either way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> He's not into it. <laughs> I wonder what will happen to the seance. In the end, it still relates to the matter of the will. So things should be considered carefully, yes. Ms. Mahi is super sus is suspicious in various ways, after all. Plus, there was that attempted poisoning, too. Incidentally. Oh, yeah. I'm free as a bird today. Ah. Oh, I know. Why don't we all go hunting? Hunting? There's a hunting ground right behind the mansion. Pheasants and other birds are bred just for the occasion. Oh, that's poor birds. Oh, how nostalgic. You still go hunt. <coughs> hunting with father. I miss those Miss days. Grace, you good? Yeah, I'm great. Thank you for asking. <coughs> so speaking of which, there was a walnut tree there. Irving, do you mind that we get, uh, went to get walnuts when we were, go when we were young? Remember? What the hell? I can't English either. Oh, yeah, I never did, actually. Remember? Where did remember come from? Exactly. Oh, no, do you remember catching those whatever when we were younger? Oh. Isn't that what I said? Um. Yeah, do you remember what we did when we get, that we went to get walnuts when we were young? Whoa. Can you read? Katie. <laughs> I know, I can't talk. <laughs> oh, no, I was more like, Katie, I can't believe you questioned that because I oh. <laughs> the answer is no. I thought you were being like, Katie. No. You too. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm very much worse. Oh, there goes my nails. You're rubbing oh, off. You're rubbing my off on me, though. Knuckles. Of course. We used to. Yeah, I know. You used to read so well. I used to read perfectly. Used like, to read to go to sleep. <laughs> flawlessly. We used to. We, we used that tree to mark where the ground was itself. Wow. Wow, that was not English either. So there's even a place to hunt here. Novels are amazing. So what do you say? I think it'd be help. I think it would really help strengthen our relationship. Unlike the past, there's no hounds now. So it may be a little difficult, though. You have to search for and get the prey yourself. Well, no objections here. It's been a while, and I'm itching to test my skills. I can't hunt. Wait, I can't hunt, but so I'll accompany my mother. I'm sorry, but I cannot kill. Is that so? Well, I won't force you. What about you? Me? He never... Uh, I mean, I never hunted before. I'll teach you. When, so why not try? I think such experience is hard to come by. Well then, I guess... I, it seems like a good way to pass the time. Alright, we're going to. Right, Irving? Yes. I'm the host, so of course I will. Is he gonna get shot? <laughs> Mr. Irving will go hunting too. Will he be alright? Wait, because in the picture all he showed was like a little stream of blood. Where's the blood? On his mouth. Oh. If that dream I saw was... Also, he looks like he's alive. He's just chilling. <laughs> really a prophetic one. Maybe something happened while hunting. Uh, my staff get ready uh, to get things ready for the hunt. They should be done by noon. So, please wait till then. With those words, Mr. Irving left the dining room. What should I do? Well, warning him apparently is well, not good. Yeah, also, so... I can't unselect... Uh, oh, see, no, hold on, I can. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, we should probably- based off of past events. <laughs> oh my god, we're gonna kill him! <laughs> we should probably stay silent. Seriously? Ready? Yeah. I'll keep quiet for now. 
I don't know if that really was a prophetic dream before. And also, if I, yeah. and if I say something wrong, I'm sure he'll think I'm strange. I'm, I'm ready for another bad end. Me too. I'm ready for the bad. I would laugh so hard, Dylan. <laughs> like I would laugh so hard <laughs> because we're trying to do. Because I would warn him, but we're trying to do what the game wants here. With that thought, I watched as silently as he walked off. That night, the guests slowly began to return from the hunt, except Mr. Irving. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? No, no, keep on reading. Keep on reading. It was nowhere to be found. Why isn't the Lord come back yet? I don't know. It seems no one else was with it. See, has seen him. I wonder if something has gone wrong. Anyway, we need to search. I was hearing the disturbing voices, words in the distance. What happened to him? Is that dream come true? Is that dream? Wait, stop! Don't press. <laughs> Is that dream really true? Wait, is, is that, that dream, dream came, came true? true? Oh. Yeah, that's not English. <laughs> I mean, it's not as bad as me, so I can't I mean, that's say. fair, but, like, that is not English. No way. Oh, it's not working. Hello. Hi. Hello. Good. Weird. I was too scared to ask Mr. Morris the details. I just... Period? <laughs> I just stood on one spot. Right? <laughs> I right? just stood on one spot, yeah, but... I... <laughs> Yeah, it should be a comma or a detour. So there should be something there. Yeah. But it's not, it's not it's, the most dramatic. Yeah, it's not, it's not that dramatic. It's like what? <sighs> we didn't see the picture! Bro, I'm like so mad, dude. Like, what the actual? Like, I tried to do what this game wanted. <laughs> and I ended up dying anyways. I think because the other one, we, we like, we got more information so we can be more consist uh, convincing. But so this time it was just like, don't do anything. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. this is this is so stupid. <laughs> like, I swear to god, like, I'm trying my hardest to do what this game wants, and then it just says, nah. Okay, let's warn him. I have to say something. I don't know if he would believe my dream, but at least I should tell him to be careful. That was my same ideology last time, but whatever. With that thought, I went after Mr. Irving. Mr. Irving, may I talk to you? You want to talk? Sure. Yeah, don't go out there. Mr. Irving stopped and looked back at me. I seems you will be hunting today. Please be careful. Oh, of course. There was always danger in hunting. No, not that. Someone may come after your life again. Uh, yes. That was just... Well, that, was, that was just what happened last night. For example, what if the participants start shooting at you? Is that not a possibility in itself? I don't think so. No. At least not during the hunt. For one thing, I'll be out on the range. Of their range. Out of range? Does that mean everyone will act separately? Yeah. When we Rockefellers hunt together, we are, we always take char charge of separate areas. So I think that's how we'll do it this time as well. As long as they stay in their areas, it'll be difficult to shoot me. We're all pretty far apart. I see. But can someone just sneak closer to a location within range? How big is this lot? Probably huge. They're rich. It's not impossible. But the hunting ground is in the woods, so I think it'd be hard to find me. I'll be my guard, though. He's losing his accent. Do please be careful. <laughs> you see, my lord, I actually had a dream. A dream? And you were in it. Um, a <laughs> dr <laughs> a dr I would love to think this is some romantic scene. Right. And she goes, I dreamed that you died. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I sometimes have prophetic dreams. That's why I knew someone was trying to poison you last night. Prophetic? I know it's hard to believe. In any case, please be careful. All right. He still seems to be on the fence about it all, but I guess it's not something you can just believe right off the bat. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, speaking of which, my lord, I will be checking for any suspicious activity around the manor on my end, too. You will, will you? Yes. I promise to do everything I can. You did. You really are like a detective. Uh, am I? I didn't. don't think it's such a big thing. Still, if anyone can get to the bottom of this, it's you. The logic behind the poison and wine incident was suburb. <laughs> was it really, though? Uh, <laughs> we failed. Yeah, we twice. No, once. Yeah. No, we, we... Yeah, I mean, we failed that one question, like, a lot. Oh. Hello? I'm back. We're back. You can I see it by the sound waves. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because I was just dead silent in here by myself. All, I was all answering moment. questions about myself because mm. I'm narcissistic. Mm -hmm. Yes. No, it's for the medical thing. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, wait, did I read this? Oh, I if, you're, if, if I were to read detective novels myself, would I be able to, would I be able to reason like that? 
Uh, who knows? I care reasons like that, and I play so many murder mysteries. Me too. Or just, I love riddles. Anyway. I like, yeah. But if you're interested, please do try to pick up some. There are so many interesting stories. That's right. Maybe I should, wait, maybe I should. What do you recommend? My recommendation? Well, let me think. Are we going to choose? Oh. The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes oh, may be a good choice as your first book. It's a collection of short stories, and all are good. <laughs> Don't worry. What are you talking about, Irving? Oh, hello. This doesn't concern you, Layla. Go away. Miss Layla came in between us, as if to interrupt. Oh, it's nothing. If I'm making here about it, then so can I. I haven't had a proper conversation with you since I arrived at the manor. Is that so? I'm sorry. That's fine. Instead, could you spend a lot of time Ew. with me today? I hear. Her. Oh. Right. I have something I have to show you, Levering. Well, something to show me. Well, something I want to sh want you to listen to more like it. I'm going to prepare, so uh, look forward to it. Will you come to the terrace in an hour or so? Sure. She got a thing for her. Like, ah! Oh my god. I stood in silence. It was like I didn't exist. Well, I, in her eyes. Yeah. I can't, can't find a good time to speak, obviously. What should I do? It's awkward being here, but I shouldn't leave without permission. Ellie, what are you doing? At that moment, Miss Noel passed by. If you're free, clean the guest rooms. Yes, right away. With that, I breathed a sigh of relief and excused myself. <laughs> ah, my ear hurts. You still have that, like, I have huge... the crazy one. I have, the little... I have a ring on it around it. Oh, I see. I got relatively new piercing. This is like a year and a half old, though. No, is it two years old? Holy crap. But it's old. But it hasn't really fully healed. Mine two years old. Oh, then mine's probably one and a half. Oh, it's a little older than two, actually. It was July 2020. Um, it's like slightly over two. Anyways, <laughs> clean the guest rooms. Maybe this is a chance to investigate the guests. I can't speak English. Who, who, who are you sassy on? Oh, we can interrupt there. <laughs> oh, let's go to the tower. Oh my god, we would get... Can bad ending, bad ending number seven. Can we do it? Can we do it? Do you want to? Yes. Okay, fine. Too late. When I looked out of the terrace, there was no one there. Okay, we're too early. Katie? Oh, Mr. Irving and Miss... <laughs> I, was, I was reading it, like, in my head. Uh, Mr. Did you Ir forget what we're doing? <laughs> yeah. Mr. Irving and Miss Layla are supposed to be meeting here, but perhaps it's still early. Alright. which what, Who are you sussy on, Katie? Um... I'm not sussy about the seance person. So, no... Really? Really? Are you sussy about her? I'm sussy about her. Oh, I'm not sussy about her. I feel like she's fine. I feel like that'd be the easy, like, you know. Yeah, fair That'd be, enough. like, way too easy. Um. Well, the one that's the hardest would probably be freaking Natalie. <laughs> yeah. Go into the kitchen. Let's go. Um, so definitely blew out of the picture. Um, uh, I don't really know about anyone else. I feel like I don't know too much about them. We'll just go in everybody's room. Who cares? Okay. Um, I don't like Leela. Layla. So let's go sleep in her room. Okay, yeah, I don't like her either. This is Miss Gr Mrs. Grace and Miss Layla's room. I guess there's no one here, huh? Wait, I'm sorry. Are they well, maybe I... there's no one here because we just saw... Sorry. No, I'm sorry. Is the beds connected or not? Because there's a divide on the bottom board, but not on the on top board. board. Yeah. Are they connected? Maybe the bottoms are just small, like, skinnier than the, the, the tops are, and they're, like, two separate beds just pushed together. Like, the foot of the beds are, like, a little skinnier for whatever reason. Oh. Oh, you're here. Or are they done with their conversation? That was, like, really fast. At that time, Mrs. Miss Layla entered her room, the room. Yes, I was about to clean. Should I leave? I'm going to practice my vi oh violin. Oh my god! <laughs> it's gonna sound so bad. Uh, also, I don't want to clean while she's here because I want to snoop. <laughs> but you can stay if you don't bother me. Violin, you play? I love violin. I wish to play violin. <laughs> yes, ever since I was a child, I'm very good. At least I am now. Irving told me otherwise a long time ago, though. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Irving told you that you weren't good? Irving was mean when he was a child. But back then, he... <laughs> Ugh. What's wrong? Well, he told me that he'd marry me if I could master Concerto Number 4 Winter. Oh. No, 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 no. Crap, what's number 4? I don't remember. From the Four Seasons. Who wrote this, Katie? Katie, do you know the... Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I don't know I'm who... pretty sure that's... I'm pretty sure that's spring. So what composer is that, Katie? Go. Such a V. I don't know. Vivaldi. 
I don't know who that is. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so I practiced very hard, and now I'm good at it. Once Irving listens to his song, he'll officially engage. I only know, like, Beethoven and, like, Bach. Mozart. And, yeah. And, like... Chopin? No. List? No. I have a book of lists literally right there. <laughs> okay. Who else is, who else is famous? Tchaikovsky? No. I don't know anything about music. Were you alive, baby? Huh? After listening to the, the song, officially engaged? Um, you said you were his fiance last night. Are you saying that was. It's as good as an engagement, right? He made a promise. That was if you can play the piece well. Plus, it was just a childhood promise. I wonder if Mr. Irving thinks that he's engaged to Mrs. <laughs> Lisa? Lisa? Oh. Picture? <laughs> That's like incorrect. It's Louise and Layla. Her name's Layla, right? Yeah, her name's Layla. Because uh, I never read her lines. So I'm kind of no. Confused. Yeah, I was like, what the heck? The only people that see her line is her mom, and her, she, that's like it. So yeah, like, so, and those are the people I voice. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, it is Layla. Ah, I don't have time to chat. I need to practice now since I still have time. Irving and I are meeting. I have a meeting arranged. Yeah, we saw it all. Miss Layla took out the violin and placed the bow on it. Oh. At that moment, one of the violin strings broke. Just replace it. Oh, it's not the time for this. I need to restring this. She fetched a bag from her wardrobe and began to rummage through it. And out came something very incrimin huh? incriminating. What is this? Is something wrong? The string is missing. I had an extra long string here inside the pouch. Oh, is he gonna get strangled? <gasps> oh. The paper bag that Miss Layla showed me. Well, it's gonna be covered in shock or whatever that is. Chalk. Oh, no, resin? I think it's called resin. Chalk. Resin? <laughs> Chalk. <laughs> rosin. Rosin, that's it. What's rosin? I'm a genius. What the heck? Where? Where did it go? Oh, I know. You stole it. I stole the string? Me? N no, it wasn't me. I didn't this do anything. This poor girl is getting accused I know. of everything. I didn't do anything. But there wasn't anyone else here while I was until I came along. It was you, alone. If you didn't steal it, then explain why it's missing. Why do I need to explain that? What should I do? Just kick her. Oh. <laughs> Investigate the situation, I guess. Yeah. No, should we get the bad end? <laughs> I'm kind of curious what happened. I, I, I am as well. I am as well. Let's do it. Okay. I didn't steal string. I'm telling the truth. Then why is it gone? You're the only one here, right? Um, this isn't leading anywhere. It's just going to circle us uh, back. Okay. okay, that's kind of boring. Even if I didn't steal it, even if I say I didn't steal it, she won't believe me. First, let me check the situation. Maybe I'll learn something. May I see the pouch, please? Sir. Sure. The fingerprint. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but are you stupid? If you're like, uh, people don't. Uh, I expected the pouch. You don't need to expect it that closely to see the obvious. <laughs> what I'm more interested in is this giant humongous fingerprint that's on the seal. There's only two things to look at. Yeah. Oh. The pouch is covered in whitish powder. What is this powder? It's a fair powder. <laughs> nice. I spilled it inside the bag this morning. I didn't know I got all over the pouch too. When you say this morning, exactly when was you it? You got lucky, honey. Well, after going for a walk with my mother, before I went to breakfast. I see. Face powder. And the seal. The pouch's seal has been broken. When was the seal broken? It wasn't open last night when I checked the before bed. <laughs> I wasn't... I haven't checked since then, though. So, did the culprit open it when stealing the string? <laughs> hmm? Is this a fingerprint? Something that looked like a fingerprint had been left on the pouch flap. Miss Layla, did you touch the pouch here? No, I didn't. Then that means that someone touched the flap after breaking the pouch seal, and the face powder was spilled immediately after that, I guess. I read about finger... I read about fingerprint collection in a novel before. Did we not just experience the one, like, literally yesterday? Yeah, I know. When you touch things, oil from your fingers remains in the form of a fingerprint. And then you can collect those prints by applying fine powder. No, people, there's people that actually don't have fingerprints. It's true. If you, like, tear off your skin? No, I mean, like, there's actually people just born without fingerprints. That's so interesting. They would be top-notch criminals. Yeah. This fingerprint may have remained here in the same way. Or just get a fingerprint burner. Or just wear gloves. No, it's still closer sometimes. I think I understood the situation pretty well. Maybe I can prove that I didn't do anything. 
Miss Layla, I kind of forget that. It, it, it seems, yeah. Anyways, uh, I'm not the culprit here. It would have been embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Impossible for me to steal a string. Thank you. Impossible? What do you mean? Of course. This Her time accent's getting stronger. <laughs> <laughs> so the guy's accent's getting weaker and her accent's getting stronger. Yeah, it really is. First, the time when the string was stolen was... It's as if a 22-year-old college student is trying to do a various voices, Katie. <laughs> Thank you for the very much specifics. Oh, are we not supposed to do? Oh, sorry. Um, probably... No, she did No. Sorry, it was after the walk and before the... What did she say again? I forget. Oh, Jesus, I should never ask you. <laughs> you never know, Katie. Kaylin! Uh, Layla. But I think it's during the walk, no? That means that someone touched the flap. But after breaking the pouch seal, the vice valve was spilled immediately then, I guess. No, higher, higher, yeah, higher, 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 higher. No. Oh, yeah, that's better. I suppose yeah. it back this morning. I didn't know. No, no, no. Uh, after going on the walk with my mom, before I went to breakfast. That's when the face powder was spilled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what we need to look at. Well, you need. We're, we're looking at when the spring was stolen. String was stolen. Yeah, it has to be bef because it has to be after the. Oh, oh no, it's no, before. It's before. That's oh, why I, I said get during it. the walk. I get it. During the walk. No, going before the walk. Oh, yeah. Wait, yes, during the walk. Yeah. I get it. Thank the Lord. I was right. Okay. I I applaud you, Katie. This is the one time. <laughs> what? The string was stolen this morning while you were going for a walk. When I was going for a walk? I was... Oh. St it was stolen that early? Okay, good. <laughs> I thought she was like, you're wrong! Yes, you seem to suspect me because I was here by myself the whole time before you came, but if the string was stolen before that, would that convince you of my innocence? How do you know that it was stolen while I was on my walk? Prove it! Well, the evidence is right here on the pouch. It's the opening. Wait, the paste powder? Or is it the opening? Wait. <laughs> it's the fingerprint! I guess, I'm guessing it's the face powder. Yeah, it's, probably. The face powder happened afterwards and it would catch onto the oils. Yeah. Yeah. The powder itself could be the proof that the string was stolen while you were on your walk. What do you mean? I don't understand. The face powder alone may not be so convincing. Oh. Oh, I got Okay. So it's opening. Oh, okay, sorry. Okay. There's some powder on the pouch flap where the seal is broken, right? That means the seal is already broken before the powder was even spilled. Ah! That's why you think it was stolen during my walk! Oh, yeah. I mean, we're an idiot. Yeah, we're, we, we are an idiot. We're an idiot. We're, we are an idiot. Yeah, a singular idiot. Oh! Oh, we're idiots! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> wow, you were really convinced I was correct. <laughs> we are an idiot. I mean, to be fair, we kind of are the same person. Yeah. So, like, it's fine. But, like... <laughs> Wow. Yes. You say you spilled the face powder after your walk. And the string was still in the pouch last night before bed. If the culprit was aiming for your absence, and the string was still in bef during the walk. I see. I think so, too. Are you convinced that I'm not the culprit? Yes. I believe you. You should thank me. Oh, uh, thank you very much for spilling your face powder. <laughs> I wonder who stole it. I can't play like this. Um, may I borrow the pouch that the string in? Hey, just play on one string, or like, the couple strings that you got. It's possible, not the idea, but possible. I'm gonna look for the culprits. Depending on what piece and what string it broke. <laughs> Hello? Oh. Discord's going crazy. It just went once, but sure, go off. <laughs> You're going to look for the culprit? Well, sure. I won't get my hopes up, though. Still, let me know if you find anything out. Yes. Excuse me. I left Miss Layla's room holding the pouch. My foot is very itchy. Keep on reading while I look for... Don't worry. Oh. Use the arrows. Time for the green room. Who's in the green room? I don't know. But we're going in the green room oh, that looks... Oh, William. Is William. That's right. That looks blue. Yeah, the blue room. I'm pretty sure this is Mr. William's room. There was nobody there. I'd better start cleaning, I suppose. Huh? What is going on, Miss William? Explain. At that time, Mr. William and Mrs. Grace came into the room together. Well. So I'm coming back, and we're gonna do a little um side note here. I got an email back from the professor, but they, he he, my name's like. Yeah. <laughs> He emailed somebody else. I just got oh. I got confused because yeah. it was. <laughs> but you got CC'd. 
Thank you. Oh, you bless you, sir. Yeah, bless bless that professor. We love I that professor. I just clever next to the microphone. I'm so sorry. Oof. But literally, okay, yeah, I want to see a little tangent. So I was asking, well, well, what, what should we call this professor? Um, this one. That one is... Give me a name. Um, Three, two, one. Professor... <laughs> okay, Snorlax. <laughs> I was going to say Snorlax. I don't know why my brain went to that. Okay, sure. so Professor Snorlax over here. Um, I need to email um, a Walgreens for a sponsor, right? So I asked... Why are you looking at me with the face? I'm not looking at you. I'm laughing. Okay. So I need to email for a sponsor. And I was like, oh, I need to get the contact of who I need to email, right? So I asked Professor Snorlax because last time she was the one that um, gave it to the previous person last year, right? So in my email, let me let me read what I said. I said, hi, uh, last year we reached out to this person for the Walgreens sponsor. Will we, will we be contacting the same person? If so, may I have his contact information to provide my, uh, my request or whatever, right? And then... <laughs> Dr. Professor Snorlax over here goes, yes, you'll reach out to the same person as this year as well. That's it. And I'm like, can I have the contact, please? But thank you too. What's this guy's name? Professor Ready? Lifesaver. Okay. <laughs> 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 Professor Lifesaver actually actually was a blessing. Oh my god, he 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 emailed the correct person for me, please. Oh my god. Sorry, I just had to give a tangent because that same Snorlax also ignored my questions in the past. Yeah. I gave this huge paragraph of like all these questions. And then she was just like, how's your day? Yeah. And I was like, good, but can you answer, please? Even even Professor Lifesaver's emailing her, being like, where is the yeah. skulls? Yeah. <laughs> I love these names, Snorlax and Lifesaver. They're really genius. <laughs> oh, courtesy, of, courtesy of me. Bless you, Lifesaver, literally. Yeah, bless Professor Lifesaver. What was I getting my phone for again? Um, I had to do something. I don't remember. I literally had to do... Oh, yeah, yeah, I was trying to mute Discord. Oh, okay. Um, Should I be William for Yeah, a be William. Um, what was his voice again? Just Give me... my voice. Oh, just, just, just my voice. Vo I don't know your voice. <laughs> well, I just need a little money. Like I said, one of my transactions fell through. So you want to borrow money from me, even though you just bought yourself a shiny new car. Oh, he's Rolls Royce. Huh? He got a Rolls Royce. Before I knew I just how bad the transaction has gone, yes. I'm just making my voice slightly lower. I have no idea how to do your voice, dude. <laughs> oh, I see. I'm sorry, but I can't. I have some financial matters I'm attending to myself. Ah, uh, I know. I'm really sorry. Oh, I must not ask you to go to Irving. He is going to marry Layla, and I don't want to make my child have a hard time. In the first place, that marriage is... What? No. Putting Layla herself aside, you're very enthusiastic about this marriage, aren't you? I don't want to mute myself. I'm scared. Why wouldn't I be? Is it only? It is only natural to want to fulfill her wishes. She's my darling daughter, my only daughter. You can do this while I read everyone's lines now. My turn. Oh God, I hate your voice though. Oh, and Grace is not yours. Oh, Grace. <laughs> of course, man, a marriage must. Is it not just have putting a... you on do not disturb? Yeah, how did you do that? Really? <laughs> Katie, I'm a literal. I'm a literal. You literally just click on your profile right here. It was there, and it's right here because you were online. Just do not disturb. Bye. Okay, read your line. No, you read it. <laughs> I heard half of it. Oh, you did. I one third of it. I didn't listen to you. Okay. Or like, like one eighth of it. Oh, you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you just read. Of course, marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, marriage must have a full future, but this union will truly strengthen both the Rockfords and my own family, so there's no problem. We'll be rock solid. Make the family rock solid? Well, this is, <laughs> that's what I thought. Mr. Williams and Mrs. Grace are both dealing with issues of their own. I don't really know the details. Besides, is it even okay for me to listen to their stories here? Anyway, I... Oh? She looked at me as if noticing me for the first time. What's going on? Hmm. How long have you been there? Um, since the beginning. You stood there quietly. The whole time. You really are clueless. Get out of here. Y yes, ma'am. I am truly sorry. She's really cross with me. I guess I shouldn't have listened in after all. Okay, it's not well, like we had a choice so to say yes well, or no. So, Katie, here's a little quiz. What were they talking about? Do you know? I wasn't- I was doing this. <laughs> You don't know either, so do you? they were talking about something about money. Yes, I know that. Oh, 
Well, I know he has inquiry of like having he's short on money even though he bought a car. But what was she? What's her inquiry on? I don't know. Not inquiry, but like troubles on. I don't know. Katie, <laughs> <laughs> do you update any of these information? No, I don't. Jesus Christ. I don't know. I I I don't know what's up with me. Like recently, the past like semester, um, information doesn't stay in my head when I'm like just told it. That's not a good sign, Katie. Like I can't like process it. You know? Read your line, Katie. <laughs> I bow deeply in left Mr. Williams' room. I'm playing with astronaut boy over here. Oh, sorry. <sighs> Press the wrong button. <laughs> when I open the door, <laughs> Louisa was standing there. Hi. She's listening in. Huh? Why are you here, Louisa? Quiet! Mm. Louisa covered my mouth and dragged me off to the side. Whew. Okay now. I was kind of freaking out there for a minute. Louisa, what were you doing there? Nothing. I was just over. I was just eavesdropping. Interesting conversation with Mr. Um, William was having, eh? Eavesdropping. Sounds like they were having quite a difficult time. Things could really blow up, don't you think? Are you having fun, Louisa? Is it? Wait. Does it matter if I am? It's a perfect way to fight off this boredom. Louisa gave me one final glare, then left. Okay, I know I get bored easily. At least I don't like eavesdrop out of boredom. Yeah. <laughs> I just eavesdrop out of convenience cakes. Oh. Don't worry about it. Okay. Boredom, huh? I wonder if everyone starts craving excitement like that after working here for so long. Anyway, I didn't really understand all of what- Yeah, I really didn't understand all of what Mr. William and Mrs. Grace were talking about. Did Louisa? Maybe she'll tell us. I'll ask her next time I see her. She loves gossiping, so... Mm. Alright, red room. This is Mr. Ewan's room. Yeah, it's a singular bed, so I guess... Yeah, see, the, 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 the foot is a little shorter than the bed width. There is no one here. I couldn't like English. Should I look around the room as well? It's clean. Search start. Where did the mouse go? Really? Actually, we don't need it. We're good. <laughs> Hiccups. Oh, God. Singular? It might be two, but I think it's singular. Where are you going to look first, Katie? Let's go good left or right. Chest. Yeah. Oh, good. I was about to just say left. So, is there something inside? I checked the drawers, but there was nothing inside. That's a disappointment. There is a pendant by the pillow. What should I do? You're gonna grab your fingerprints on it. What do you do, Kitty? Oh. Investigate? Duh. This pendant. It's more like a locket. Who is this person? Inside, there is a picture of a thin, middle-aged woman. And then all of a sudden, someone came in and bad end. I think she looks like Mr. Ewan. I was anticipating that. Is this his mother? I oh, hey. Know. Good. We're good. Is there something inside? I checked the drawers, but there was nothing inside. Nice. Inside the bag. Inside was the bag that Mr. Ewan brought with him. What should I do? I know it's not good, but I may find something about Mr. Ewan. Just a little. Looking inside, I found a wallet, clothes, daily necessities, and the like. Nothing to be concerned about, really. Just things that any commoner would carry. His everyday life may be as simple as ours. I checked everything here. This locket was the only thing that got my attention. I think this is important. Oh. What are you doing in here? Looking back, Mr. Ewan was standing behind me. How did that happen? How long was he watching me for? What are you holding my pendant? Trying to steal it or something? It's only cheap, you know. I don't steal. I was just lifting it up so that I could dust your bed. Yes. Then what? You just thought you snoop around my room, huh? I... You sure are noisy. Noisy? Nosy. <laughs> nosy. Look at his face. He looks a little like... <laughs> <laughs> what? Wait, what? Did your master tell you to check on me or something? He, he didn't. No, something piqued my interest. That's all. It was all me. What are you so interested in? Tell me. Well, what should I do? I mean, it's all out in the open now. Maybe I should just ask. I'm curious about you. Oh. Go, Katie. Uh. Oh, we already know this one's the will, no? Yeah, right? So the top, I guess? Who is the person in the picture? My mother. I knew it. She does look like you, Mr. Ewan. Yeah, she was beautiful then. She was nothing but skin and bones by the time of her death. Oh, I probably should have said that so. <laughs> so she's passed away. Oh, wait. Already. I know, I was about to ask. Ah, I hate you. How do you know exactly what I'm saying? Suddenly, Mr. Ewan stared at me. What's wrong? Oh, 
It's just my mother was made like you. She worked for a baron and his family. Your mother too? Really? There was an epidemic around, going around at the time. Oh yeah, they were talking about an epidemic. Mm. Uh, he got to her master, and she had to take care of him. But then she got infected herself. He collapsed to the floor one day, and she... And eventually, the disease claimed her life. Whoa! The Baron's family was horrible. As soon as she collapsed, they um, fired her and kicked her out. Um, oh. Sorry, continue. Oh, I was just gonna say his finger looked kind of broken there. But oh, I should have checked. Yeah, that's why I was like, um, um. You'll probably see it again in the future. Huh? But she only collapsed because of the... Yeah, why does his finger look like that? It's his hair. No, like, it's the pinky. Yeah, the right? hair. No, 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 not the hair oh, part. Like the, the yeah, line. Like, like connection up to yeah, the, the... Yeah, I got you. Yeah, it no, looks like wrong. I think it's just a line, but yeah. <laughs> For a noble, I mean, it's either useful or, you, or not. That's all they care about. No, how, no matter how loyal they are, when you come and you become useless, they're done with you. I wonder if this is one of the reasons why Mr. Ewan hates Halila and the, Layla go away. And the others, because of how nobles treated him and his family. I said go away because Siri was here, by the way. <laughs> oh, you I just be said, careful too. I just said her name. Okay, good. She's fine. You didn't say hey, though. Well, have, did I say anything of the like in that sentence when she got summoned? Hey, Siri. Oh, you activated mine. Hey, Siri. I miss there's something else I can help with. <laughs> hey, Siri. Oh, you activated mine. Siri, who killed... Or actually, <laughs> look up spoilers. Yeah, gonna... you're gonna you're gonna do it, dude. Siri. Siri. Oh, hey Siri. Sorry. Oh my god. What's the best way to kill somebody? No need to apologize. So it said, "Hey Siri, sorry, my god. What's the best way to kill somebody?" We're gonna go on a loop now. It's okay. What? Siri, what's the best way to kill someone? I don't know how to respond to that. <laughs> <laughs> nice. She what? knows too much. Oh shoot, where's the- okay, there you go. That's my line, isn't it? No matter how yeah. hard you work you're for the master, you won't get rewarded. Hey, we got his love! We'll get his love, sorry. <laughs> Is he saying that out of concern for me? Because of how I tried to do too much for Mr. Irving. I kinda wanted to just become his love so that Layla could just be Me too, me too, me too, me too, <laughs> me too. so bad. Me too. I don't like her! I don't like Layla! We were using him! Oh, but I think they would be cute. <laughs> Ah, uh, sorry. I need to get the mouse. It's, like, away from me. I think they would be cute together. Yeah, they could talk about Sherlock. Yeah. Maybe Owen is right. I mean, no. Mr. Irving would never be so heartless. But still, effort doesn't necessarily guarantee a reward. But I still think that I want to do everything I can to protect Mr. Irving's life. Oh. Oh, we got to ask them both. Okay. I'd like to ask why you were called to the manor, Mr. Owen. Did you really mean what you said to Mr. Irving last night? When I said... When I said to him that I actually that I were actually I are actually brother oh him when and I, I are actually a yeah, brother there you sorry. Go. I'm pretty serious. Well think about it. Everyone at the seance, they're all family, except for that medium. It doesn't make sense for me to be the odd one out, right? Maybe we're not brothers. But we could be we could be related, no? That's true. But it didn't seem like anyone knew who Mr. Ewan was. R would relatives act like that to each other? Anything else you want to ask? Nope. This is enough. Thank you for sharing those things with me. Don't mention it. You can ask, you can make it up to me by just answering properly when I ask you something. Well, okay. I will. If I can. I don't like to be in debt to somebody that's potentially a culprit. Yeah. That's an old winner. Yeah. Alright, that's a promise. I wonder what he'll ask me. I'm a little worried. Though still slightly anxious at the thought, I left Mr. Ewan's room. 